Hey y'all, Courtney Lyons here with Diamonds Are a Girl's Best Friend and today I have a really fun video for you. Uh, my channel is all things diamond painting and today my diamond painting video is most anticipated kits that I own. So the kits that I'm like most excited for and that are like my top tier ones and I could honestly <laughs> could not narrow it down past 15. Technically 16 because I did do an honorable mention um, and you'll see that. But I thought that this would be kind of like a really fun game if we did this in a way like that it would be a game. So before each kit, I'm going to kind of have like a screen over the top and it's going to be at the bottom. So it's going to say which number it is. So like number 15 and at the bottom, it's going to give a tiny like title slash description and you guys can guess which one it might be. So the best way to do well, and I'd, I'd seriously do this with a piece of paper and a pencil if you guys want to participate. But go and watch and i'll link it below go and watch my um it's my stash video of all the diamond paintings i have in my stash of course there are a few more now of course and there's mm, only one i think in this video that would not be in the stash video so if you go and watch that and then you know what's in my stash and then the clues will give you which is the next number so i thought it might be kind of a fun like little guessing game if you guys wanted to participate i'd give you plenty of time to or maybe like pause the video and write down which number and i don't know like i think it would be fun <laughs> so we'll try it and uh it'd be Hi, fun me. to see like how many you guys got right or wrong in the in the in the comments below go ahead and put in the comments below after this video is over and be like hey i got 11 out of the 16 so okay that's it guys let's go ahead and get started on it um i'm really excited for this i've been really excited to do this one for a long time my membership members did were the ones who voted on this video so it's going to come out to you guys early you'll see this first like about a few days earlier than everybody else so it'll be fun thanks for watching guys don't forget to hit that like button that really helps me out and then subscribe if you haven't already and let's get started Alright, scratch what I said earlier, this is going to be out of 15, because 16 is not going to count, because it's an honorable mention, it's already a mystery kit, and um, it is the Nathaniel Mortensen, it's Mortensen? Anyway, I won't say anything more than that, because it's mystery, and I'll leave it for mystery for everybody, it is no longer available, as mystery kits usually aren't, if they sell out, and yeah, this is the first real mystery kit that I've seen that I'm like, oh my gosh, I have to have that. Okay. So that's honorable mention. Number 15, this one reminds me of home. This one's not going to be easy to guess, but pause. Roll. Cozy Coffee Cabin. I believe that's what it's called. And this is a Dominic Davison. So it's my first Dominic Davison, and I got this from Robin. Oh my gosh, Robin, thank you so much. I'm pretty sure this is my husband's favorite kit that he's ever gotten. Here is the rendering for it um, that we've ever gotten, I mean, especially like that was just so kind of you to send this this is right down our alley it does totally remind me of home this being home where we are now um lakeside it's just with the mountains and everything absolutely love it okay okay this next one is a pastel delight um i do have quite a few pastel kits pause if you need to <laughs> i didn't give you enough time you guys know to pause by now on that title screen but yes, this is Mermaid Bedroom. This is Mrs. Buttered D, or yeah, Mrs. Buttered D. I still get that confused sometimes, but she has actually said on one of my videos that it's Mrs. Buttered D with a D at the end. This is the rendering, and I adore these colors, guys. I love the colors so much. That's probably the main reason, and also her artwork is just adorable in general, but especially the art. Like, I've seen this one finished, and also from now on, the rest of them are Diamond Art Club ones. And so I'll show you guys the finishes from now on. The reason the rest are Diamond Art Club is because their quality really is the best. So that's what I look forward to the most. But yes, I love it. this one finished. Okay, number 13, I want to live here. Most anticipated gets, where do I want to live? This one's hard. Some of these are hard. Cottage by the Sea. I hope you guys know to pause now before the next one. Um, if I ever do this again, let me know if I'm going too fast, if I need to leave that longer or what, but anyway, this is my Chuck Pinson, one of my Chuck Pinsons, oh my dear goodness, look how gorgeous this is with the lighthouse and the sea and the cottage and those, all those flowers, what a beautiful sunset, I love the kind of muted tone to this, I don't know how to explain, what would you call that, 
I, I don't even know how you'd explain this, but here it is finished. I'm always so blown away about how, how vibrant it is when it's actually done. I just think that's amazing. So I'm really looking forward to this kit. It looks like so much fun, like a lot of confetti, but a lot of fun. And the house I think is gonna be a lot of fun with those bricks too, and especially the sea. Okay, ethereal rainbow. So which one would I have that's ethereal rainbow? Pause. This is dreamscape, and this is color out of place. Oh my gosh. You know what I'm going to do with this one? I'm going to go get the kit for from, oh, what is it? DP with sparklers for all the enhancements that you can do. And this is the rendering. And, and do that because holy cow, think about how cool that would be to just have this especially sparkly and blinged up. I just think that's going to be a blast. So yeah, I'm really excited for that. I really, really loved getting to do enhancements. I love changing them up like that. Okay, so this is actually, this is a finished one, but I'm pretty sure this has not had the enhancements on it. So just imagine with all the extra ones on there, I'm so excited. Just such a beautiful ethereal rainbow. Okay, so the next one is Whimsical Christmas Pear. Don't forget to pause here if you want to take time to maybe think about what this one might be. This is um, Gnome for the Holidays. Guys, I have to have all of Marjorie Sarnat's gnomes i have to i have three of them the beach one that came out that totally broke a low buy i had to have it i have it now it was on the contender to replace this one but i just love the colors on this one so the beach one's really good they have um she has a halloween one if that comes out an absolute must buy will buy i don't care if i'm on a complete no buy i will buy it so this is this one finished i believe there might be an enhancement pack for this too i know for sure that they do have that for the um valentine one so definitely excited for this kit a whole lot it's just so much fun it's it's cute gnomes but in a very very artistic way all right number 10 sly beauty let's pause here and think about what that might be on here what animals are called sly <laughs> i didn't give you enough time um hawthorne this is definitely my oldest kit on this list um, as far as, not that I've had, but um, oldest as in the latest or the earliest release um, that I have on here from Diamond Art Club. And guys, it's um, Izzy Izzet. No, Eve Izzet. I always say Izzy Izzet. It's Eve Izzet. Look how cute he is. He's got the hawthorn berries and the leaves and his little face and his little tail rubbing around his face. And I think this has been on a few of my videos because I love it so much. So this is it finished. I know it's going to be the old drills. I've now come to realize that I actually love the old drills too. So I will no longer be getting rid of any with the old drills. But uh, yeah, super excited for this one. Okay, number nine, <coughs> a child's dream shop. Pause here if you need to holiday shop so this one is i believe artbeat studios and when i first saw this this is one of my first diamond art club purchases because i saw this and i was like i would have something to do in every single square <laughs> like seriously if i did this one it would there would be something fun to do in each and every single one of these squares on here and i'm so excited for that plus the rendering is amazing you get so much detail for such small things like you know what they are that just takes so much skill in rendering. Diamond Art Club's team has a lot of skill <laughs> with rendering, and it's just adorable. So this is kind of a blurrier picture, but you can kind of get the idea. That rocking horse right there is just to die for. I'm so excited for to this uh, to do this. I'm not sure when. I think this is definitely a rainy day Christmas kit. I have so many by now. <laughs> okay, number eight. What matters is the heart inside. Ooh, I said here inside. It's heart inside. Okay, so that's a quote from Kiki's Delivery Service. I love that movie so much. I love the flowers in this one. I love the cat. I love that she's flying. Just the colors in this is amazing. Plus, it's nostalgic because this is a movie I used to watch as a kid all the time. <coughs> Sorry, I have a tickle in my throat. And, yeah, so the quote... Um, is when her mom when she's like talk I don't know if I know it from heart but she's talking to her mom about how she doesn't like her dress and she's like the dress doesn't matter it's the heart that's inside it and it's just one of my favorite quotes from it it's such a good movie if you haven't seen it yet go watch that and I absolutely love love this painting I think it's gorgeous here it is finished and uh, guys there's so many people that finished this one I believe this is on Diamond Art Club's top selling kit 
<coughs> I believe this is the most that they've sold. Sorry, we're all getting sick here, so I wouldn't be surprised if I am too. So excuse my occasional coughing. But the colors in this, the colors. Okay, number seven, spooky hot chocolates. <laughs> so pause. Ghost Cafe. Guys, I absolutely love Stephanie Marie, which is the artist. I am so surprised that she doesn't have more out there. I have, <laughs> I've requested that if anything comes out that Stephanie Marie, if I could please, 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 please have it from Diamond Art Club, but I totally, if it, if I don't, like, it's totally fine, and I will buy it right away. I love Stephanie Marie. I don't know what it is about her artwork. I mean, it's beautiful. I don't know what it is, but something, go look her up on Instagram. Something about it is amazing, and it's just, it just hits me. <laughs> I don't know how to way to explain it. It's perfect, and I love all of her art. And this one also, the colors are just the perfect combination. And the ghost dudes are so dang cute. This is the this is the kit finished. So um, it'd be interesting to see if any of the viewers are the people who put the like their reviews on Diamond Art Club for the finished ones. Let me know if you are. Number six, the greatest gift ever given. Pause here. Get so many guys. You know that I am very religious. Um, I am a Christian, and I am so I belong to the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter Day Saints. A lot of you guys know us as Mormons, which we never really call ourselves that, but <laughs> that's okay. And this is the rendering. This one just speaks to me so much. I honestly, I like want to do this one right away so I can hang it up and have this beautiful picture of Christ in my home. But I also don't want this one to be done because I, I want it so beautiful. I'm so anticipating it. I don't want it to be done. Look at the colors. By the way, this is Mandy Manzano. I forgot to say that. I did pick up her one. I forget what it's called, but it's Jesus with the um, basket of loaves and fishes. And he's got a, a little boy's handing it to him. It's not. It's so many neutral colors, but I had to have it. I love the message. Okay, number five. Um, birds of a flower. So instead of birds of a feather, birds of a flower, pause. <laughs> Did I give you enough time to pause? So this is Hydrangea Garden Birds. And who is this? That's right. This is Gina Jane. I had to look up and, and pause and look up. Guys, look at these hydrangeas. Ugh, the colors in this. There are so many flowers. So many amazing colors. Those blues. Holy cow. And the birds. And I have so many fun ideas for metallics for the fence and the watering can and blue ABs for the flowers. There's already actually quite a few ABs. I don't remember how many, but there's a lot of ABs. I think this is before fairy dust. Um, if not, um, I think there's fairy dust in there too. So this is finished. Um, it's in a frame, so it's kind of hard to see, but absolutely gorgeous. Those blues, they did not lose any color. They did amazing with the color choices and the rendering. Once again, amazing rendering, so much detail in the rendering that you wouldn't get if it was computer rendered. Okay, love it. Number four, Sand Treasure. I think these later ones might be a little bit easier to guess than the earlier ones. Sorry. This is Beach Comer's Bounty. Oh my gosh. Okay, Crafting with Shay has finished this. Go check out her videos to see it finished. She, I think she did the enhancement pack. Anyway, I am totally going to get the enhancement pack from DP with Sparklish for this because, oh my gosh, <laughs> it is so beautiful. Once again, those blues... Guys, one of my favorite things to do when I go to the beach is to pick up shells or anything that's just trinkets or special. I should have been a mermaid. Let's face it. Just anything that has water or cute little trinkets like this, I love. Look at it finished. This one's maybe not um, the best photo that I could have grabbed, but it is still stunning. Stunning, stunning. Um, once again, go check out Crafting O'Shea to see it finished. Okay. This is Glassy Flowers. I'll give you time. You probably already guessed this one really fast. Stained Glass Flower Garden. Oh my gosh. When this first came out, I completely missed it. It was um, Black Friday last year, which I didn't know much about picking paintings up from Diamond Art Club at that time. And here's the rendering. And so I didn't, I wasn't fast enough. I should have just picked it up really fast along with uh, Under the Stairs, but I did end up getting Under the Stairs. Um, because I think this is actually Black Friday, or, or Cyber Monday, not Black Friday. So many for Cyber Monday are the ones that I wanted. But anyway, it could have been Black Friday. Doesn't matter. It's around the same time. And I'm so excited to have this one finally because I missed out. And I'm glad that I finally have it. This is it finished. 
Also, there is a DP with Sparklers Enhancement Pack. I will be picking that up for sure. And I have the mini one that's in rounds. And I'll also be picking up that and doing a whole video where I'm showing both of them. And I think they'll be really good companion pieces together. Okay, guys, number two. Lizards and fishes and snakes. Oh my, I should have put fishes. Fish, fish, pause. Did I give you enough time to pause? I'm sorry. Little Lizard Garden. Okay, Michaela Renee is working on this right now. So if you want to see it finished, go check that out. I believe Lindsay is also working on this, Emeralds and Fairy Lights. I haven't seen her do a finish, I don't think, but or she's working on it. Whatever um, it the case is, I you you'll see finished ones on here soon. But look at the colors on this. I love succulents. The colors are amazing. They remind me of Satura. I'm so excited to work on this. And then I do know where the specials placements are. Amazing. I'm really hoping DP with Sparklers comes out with an enhancement pack for this one too. This is enough. This is it. Finished. So pretty. Oh my gosh. The colors are so much deeper when you see them finished in comparison. I know some of you guys are like, ew, snake. And I know some, some people were going to try to chart out the snake i actually love it i think it's super cute okay last one guys number one seascape beauty can you guess what this is pause right here if you need to beauty in the clouds when i saw this come out i did not know it was going to sell out so fast but i saw that and i was like yeah i have to have that and i've been buying a few so i was like i really can't but this one absolutely I needed to have this one and at first I thought there's so many neutrals in that am I going to like that do I just love the artwork but then not really like the diamond painting part of it but I've seen it finish since and it and also just seeing the color palette there are so many different colors if they if you're wondering about a neutral one don't worry about it I promise you you'll still love the drills and still love the colors I mean with the exception of a few but something like this where you think it's neutral it's not nearly as neutral as you think look at the finish here look how many colors are just in that water i'm so excited for this guys this is my absolutely all-time most anticipated kit is beauty in the clouds holy cow i don't even know if i'm ever gonna do this because i just love it so much i just want to save it all right that's it guys i hope you enjoyed um i had a ton of fun putting it together i especially just had fun finding the ones that i knew that i would like picking and choosing there's still so many that I'm really excited for. I, I'm seriously, if I'm not excited for the kit that I have, I de-stash it. So I'm excited for each and every one of these ones that I have. Like, all of the ones that I have. But it was really hard to narrow it down yeah. to even just 16. So, but you hear my baby in the back. We're about to go grocery shopping. So, thanks guys for joining me. Um, had so much fun. I hope you guys did too. And if you did make it this far and you didn't participate in the game, and comment down below. Go ahead and comment. Um... Just which one was your favorite out of the ones that I put up there. So, okay, thanks. Bye. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. How are you so adorable? Hmm? Your rubber belly. Your rubber, oh, sorry. Let's scratch that here. Yeah. Okay, now we're cute again. But that was cute too. Cozy, wozy, was a gooby. Ah.